yo it's intro what are we saying final video of the year do we like my glasses yes or no i am giving um an interesting vibe we'll put it that way to say the least today we're going to be taking a look at my website you might have noticed that my website's been under construction for pretty much a year now been hosting it with this amazing company called ready mag and it kind of worked out perfectly because they reached out to me saying we've noticed you're using our thing do you want to collaborate on a video but yeah i thought it would be the perfect way to end the year um doing something that i've been meaning to do at the start of the year do you get me if you're not familiar with ready mag firstly where have you been secondly i'll tell you a little bit about it it's an online based design tool for building websites landing pages pictures all that kind of stuff you don't need any coding experience and yeah you don't need to download anything it's literally browser based and you can just google readymag and off you go the thing i really like about it and what stood out to me is i don't know it just really appeals to the designer like if you're a designer or an artist I don't know it just feels like designer focused if you're in a rush for time you can use presets they got loads of presets which come with like built-in animations um elements menus and interactive kind of like bits and bobs throughout the video as well i'm going to be referring to loads of the self-help videos and documentation that ready mag have so also this video is gonna be um voiceover for the most part because at the time of recording i had some crazy bronchitis like if you're in the uk there's something going around some mad crazy cough flu situation and i'm just on my way out of it now but yeah it's gonna be a voiceover video so before i jump into designing my website i want to focus on like how important it is to have really good pre-production i went through the ready mag website of the year archive going through just looking at all the sites that sort of ready mag picked as like exemplary um examples of like what crazy stuff you can build with this crazy tool so yeah i got some ideas down and just kind of wanted to know what I wanted before I went into designing the site. Yeah, let's talk about um, the landing page for a second. You can see I've blurred them out, but I've been using ReadyMag for like a year um, to for pitches. Um, I've made some temporary websites where I wanted to like share information with a few people, but wanted it formatted in, in a specific way. Sometimes it could be better than sending a PDF because you can have videos and motion elements and stuff in it but yeah let's go into my site as you can see there wasn't a lot going on <laughs> and actually before it used to say in the corner new site coming in in february and then in february i changed it to jan to january march <laughs> and then in march i would change it to the next month the next month it got to september i was like bro okay like I need to, I've just been I've just been procrastinating not that it's difficult to build the site I just have had a lot of things going on in my life and moving and holidays and just the life stuff got in the way so I didn't have a chance to do this until now first thing I did was go through the extensive library of um, templates it's as easy as clicking the pages and then they pop up on the left side of the pane in your pages panel i'm going to be using the e-commerce templates at some point in the new year for an exciting project so yeah just have a look through scour through see which one speaks to you and yeah it's light work you basically have already a crazy template to kind of like start building upon but i switched over to this like blue theme really loving um ultramarine blue at the moment as you can probably see from <laughs> my videos and like other stuff that i've been up to i don't know how i feel about these glasses bro i feel like i look a bit condescending maybe i just have a condescending vibe <laughs> i hope not started the arduous process of trying to find a font and making small adjustments and this is just a designer thing man you're gonna be 
questioning whether it's the right font till the very end literally flip-flopping from sans serif to serif even thinking do i want to have the full word do i want a line break like yeah then i got sick of the blue so we moved over to orange it's all about experimentation and honestly with ready mag it, it just it feels so natural to do you know um right here i'm playing around with this really cool feature called hotspots which to me is like whoa I mean it's, it's simply elegant do you understand you hover over the trigger and then out pops a menu or like a little nugget of information or whatever you want to program it to be here i'm playing around with grids if that's your thing there's an integrated grid guide snapping system me personally i'm a messy girl i don't do the grid thing um but each to their own you understand here i'm actually using a preset um to get my text to slide across the bottom and there we go we've got my little catchphrase fundamentally flawed and artificially intelligent and yeah presets are a sick little feature where you can automate a lot of like animations or interactive things and it just does it for you and it's sick but it's so highly customizable so at this point i um called my friends jd big up you big up the rooch and i was like bro like does my website remind you of something because it was evoking something in my mind and i could not figure out for the life of me what it was and then he was like yo it's given lorax and that <laughs> that's not my intentions that's not what i'm going for and here I'm experimenting with bringing in a picture as a background. Now, I don't know about you, but I really like it. I really like it. It's a still from one of my old videos. And yeah, I never thought I'd be a picture splash landing page kind of person, but it's kind of going hard. So I just ran with it. I ran with it and we like it a lot more than the Lorac. But yeah, that was the landing page done cool let's move forward onto the about page i think i show face in this part of the video so i'll see you in a second decided to show you my face now because i feel like i don't look like deaf i feel like i should be writing this in third person oh, i hate describing what i do you know sometimes i just tell people i'm unemployed like the other day I went into my old workplace I used to work at a supermarket and I bumped into someone there they were like oh so what do you do now and sometimes I just say I'm unemployed <laughs> because it's easier than actually explaining what I do which even now I don't know <laughs> mm. raised in the trend <laughs> <laughs> of south east I'm trying to get out of here intra <laughs> <laughs> I feel so embarrassed right now <laughs> that's not awful that's not that's not the worst thing ever I think I want to do a little sort of like horizontal scroll situation yeah so let's do that now just gonna watch a quick video on it I'm gonna add a little like Shape. I'm gonna animate this on load. I'm gonna rotate it 360 degrees. I'm gonna change ease into linear. I'm gonna make the duration eight seconds. Then they scroll, and then I'm gonna put some text on this side. Get in the hang of this. It's actually so. It's so easy. I'm not gonna lie. Don't put the pressure to make the best website that's ever been created ever and then a history of humanity straight away. Just 
do what feels right. If I'm gonna come back to this and add more some point in the future, but I wanna move on to the next page, which is probably the most important page in it. So we're on the works page now. I kept one of those little pop-up windows that came with my original theme because I really like the idea of little interactive elements so the user can press the little X and yeah just make it feel almost like a little graphical user interface so I started bringing in a bunch of pictures of my work which is really nice because I don't really post a lot of work on my socials I don't know I'm just an embarrassed girl I get embarrassed like I get embarrassed easily and I don't really post my work coming up this really cool thing which I think you guys will like they're called shots you drag in a video of your choice and ready mag has this splicing algorithm which cuts up your video into short little motion frames you can see on the right you can like resize it and then change the trigger it can be scrolling hovering clicking and there you go as you scroll the frames play sequentially which is so cool and um i think it's 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 my favorite little ready mag nugget so yeah i put in all my artwork for now um there's a lot more artwork i haven't put in here but i did this in one day so i'm gonna be adding it as i feel comfortable as time goes on but yeah this is the works page at the end of the day what we came up with i ended up doing a little hover situation so you hover over the artworks to play them over here like that also if you don't know about brighter days if you're in london valentine's day weekend there's only really one place you're gonna want to be and if you don't know about them you're sleeping you're sleeping wake up right now love to all you man um so yeah this is the art and i'll be adding more as time goes on but this is just a good starting point and obviously large up my girl nia i love you infinitely i love making art with you more life we're gonna be doing some crazy stuff in the coming years i'm so excited for what we're gonna put together it's exciting 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 stuff so now we're on to the contact page and yeah simple ones simple ones gonna do a little color change gonna put in another preset gonna use a form preset and then just make little modifications and changes and customization it's such an intuitive interface um also just they throw in little cute little things like each time you create a new text field it drops like an inspirational quote instead of lorem ipsum filler text which is so cute like i love stuff like that i think that's the main thing i got from ready mag is how thoughtful it feels when you're using it i feel like it, it feels like it was designed by designers i don't know if that's true but that's the vibe that i'm getting and then finally i wanted to touch on mobile which is super important especially in 2023 2024 there's this little button you can press which basically takes your desktop layout and shrink it down into a single column layout to save you time and you can go in and make little adjustments here's me just finessing the mobile layout for the contact page it's a bummer like you spent all this time making the desktop and then everyone's going to be looking at it on a tiny little screen so it is an important part of the web design process for sure from there publishing is super simple again like they've really thought about every part of the process and making it as easy as possible for you or like designers that don't have like programming experience that kind of thing so the last thing i wanted to do was a bit of user interface testing because that's what they always teach you at uni you gotta test your systems this is a very basic system but yeah so i called up my friend johanna and saw what she had to say about it. Hey girl, can I get you to do some UX review quickly for me? Sure. Thank you so much. You know, I'm a tech girl. I love you too. <laughs> and whenever you're ready, please just type in internetgirl.com. Thank you. <coughs> My gosh. Oh, bomba clutch. Ooh. 
Maybe type in HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash. <laughs> Hold on, I'm a little bit of a dummy. Oh, 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 <laughs> I like this. Just this navigate cute. it however you want to and we'll do a little user interface review. About. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Sorry, 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 sorry. The first five words took me out. That's funny. That's very funny. I feel understand like. Your, listen, I don't listen, understand listen. Your I feel like all. <laughs> Wait. Jamaica road problems. Sorry. Listen, listen. I feel like all of South East is trenches. Because no, look at I'm us not. now. We're trying to get out. Oh, you can play a game. No, it's not a game. <laughs> How did you make the website? Ready mag, YouTube videos coming out on it. Second, it's really nice to see like the graphics and like, yeah, blown film. up, blown up, innit? yeah, blown up because they're always that tiny Instagram scale, yeah. But you can actually see like this is sick, yeah. The bread, the bread is amazing. Like, I really want to eat bread. I'm glad you Not like the it. the kangaroo, is that bad? I'm, um, I have a phobia of kangaroos. Oh. Aww. It's not funny, bro. They're actually ter they're terrifying. I like this. I'm gonna refrain from saying anything, but yeah. But yeah, thank you. I'm gonna put you in my video. Thanks, babe. Love you, sis. Love you too. Um. So yeah, let's talk about recess. Is it in Paris? Okay. So they have. Love you, sister. That's my girl right there. And yeah. So that was my little behind the scenes process of how I built this website in literally like a couple hours. It's kind of been beautiful to work with them on this video. Um, Cause yeah, I've been a big fan. <laughs> I've been fangirling for some time. Yeah, it's very cool. It's very cool. If you're needing a new website, portfolio, landing page, e-commerce situation, um, hit up ready mag bro it's free to try it's free to build your site and publish it on a ready mag domain that's all completely free and if you want to take it to another level have loads of projects that kind of thing they've got different payment plan options if you feel so inclined i've got a little link downstairs in the description that will give you a cute little discount on whatever ready mag plan you choose the discount applies to all of them so yeah please if you're going on to the site don't send me bare random inquiries bro like i know i'm about to get the most wacky like just nonsensical stream of consciousness inquiries so if you if you feel like you have to do that do what you have to do do you understand do what you have to do if it's funny i probably will reply to it we've made it we pulled through We've accomplished what we had to accomplish. That's one final box to tick off before we wrap up 2023, which is an interesting year for sure. Let me know what you guys' years has been like and what you're aspiring to do in the future year. It's been a crazy one. And I'm sending my heartfelt love and thoughts to everyone going through a difficult time right now. It can be a very difficult time of year, but we're all in it together we're all in it together trolling it also shout out my guy podge honestly one of the goats in 3d hold on sorry and yeah this peculiar little guy i think he's selling them i'm not sure or well, he's just sent them out to a few people but thank you so much it's going on my keys um yeah so that's about it love you guys